you know, some of us have uh, good ideas, bad ideas, but most of us don't act on these ideas. However, some of us do. And, and, and this dude in this video, or dudes, or chicks, I don't even really know just yet, they did some crazy elaborate gas stealing thing and had an apparatus in a truck and all like bro it, like my brain is still trying to comprehend what i was reading in the description and i was just like yeah i'm just gonna jump on and watch this with the people so go uh, yeah without further ado before my brain shuts down trying to understand this let's just jump right in this video all right let's go <laughs> What's going down, everybody? It's your boy. We back for another one, man. And yeah, like you heard in that intro, my brain is still trying to comprehend this. I don't really know, so I'm just going to go ahead and just jump into it. Shout out to, uh, what is this, Police Insider. Original link's in the description below if you don't want to watch this with me. All right? I love you guys. <laughs> Let's do this. I, I just, I got to figure 2024, it out. two men arrived at a gas pump with a device that allowed them to bypass the pump's security and take as much gas as they wanted. How? After stealing approximately 300 How? gallons of fuel over the course of 20 minutes, one of the... Where do you get that at? Where do you just get a machine or a device, rather, that just allows you to bypass the, the pump and take what you need? Like, the internet is an amazing place. I'm just saying, God damn. He's noticed who did this. Thing. The a call from asset protection, loss prevention, um... The corporate from Wawa and uh, David and he asked me if there was a vehicle parked at pump number 13 which I uh, agreed that there was it was a white van and uh, he asked me if there was any movement on the register where we could see the fuel pumping and I said no there was nothing registering on pump 13 and he said I do believe they're pumping fuel right now mm -hmm. he said I believe there's a theft in progress of your diesel how he is said, he able to be notified of the like, how is he able to be notified the pump was on? Is there a certain... So he explained cameras. to me that they receive an alert in loss prevention or asset protection, that they receive an alert that there is, uh, once fuel is actively pumping for a certain amount of time. Okay. I believe he said it's 18 minutes or 19 minutes or you something like that. Did you pay for gas? I don't pay for gas. Huh? No. You did not pay for gas. No. Did you just get gas? No. No. Okay. Do you have an idea on you? Whoa. I'm just, what, what is going on? So what were you doing at the pump? And of course, no, I, look, yes, I, I don't want to be that guy. I'm not. I don't want to be that guy. But <laughs> I'm going to just be that guy. Why is it the black guy that's scamming? You know what I'm saying? He definitely, he definitely not... You know what I'm saying? He got that accent. You know what I'm saying? Like we know we he got that 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 accent that you know kind of gives it away that he might be from a place that you know they scam on a regular to get by. You know what I'm saying? Like where he's from, you know, finding little ways to scam and do things like this might be accepted or at least you know turn the other cheek type situations. You know what I'm saying? Like I'm just saying. I'm just saying. I'm gonna be that guy. I, I'm my bad. My bad. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> 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 Yeah. He gets a notification. Okay. We don't in the store. They do at Asset Protection that the that there's active fuel pumping, and then they look. Okay. Um, and David, you said mm -hmm. he's, yes. a, he's not located on scene, or correct? No. Where is he located? I believe it's Orlando. Orlando. About okay. So short. he's off yes. property. He's off site. He yeah, receives absolutely. a notification, mm -hmm. and then that prompts him to call you. It prompted him to view the cameras remotely. Okay. And then he, once he saw a white van, which definitely wouldn't justify 20 minutes of active fuel mm -hmm. pumping, mm -hmm. um, that was when he called me. And he okay. told me, you know, once I confirmed that there was a vehicle and he still saw the gas going, he can see that I can't. And you reconfirmed that the vehicle, the white yes, van, was still just, located on... He said on this like nine yes, times, The vehicle bro. was still located on pump 13. The you two men had rigged their van the with a large question, fuel tank and, and were driving around the block. They were essentially the sitting on a bomb. There's somebody else in the van with you? Hmm? There's somebody else in the van with you? Yes. Who? Hmm? Who's in the van with you? My friend. Your friend? Yes. Okay. Say right there. Bro, so I want to go to the town and find it. Yeah, it's good to be he asked me again if I saw a vehicle or if I saw any fuel registering on the register, which I did not. Okay. That's our only way of seeing gas 
leaving the pump, mm -hmm. and I saw none of that, so he asked me then to call 911 and let them know that there was a fuel theft in progress. Hello. Hello. What's going on here today? Are you guys pumping gas? Are you guys getting gas? 1014 units. Back out for the oh, okay. All right. And then I sent a uh, <laughs> uh, associate outside to get a tag <laughs> number, which no he got English. a picture of the tag, just in case the vehicle <laughs> yeah, I don't know. I know what you're saying, um, but then, I'm going to you know, pretend like I don't I stayed on the phone with him for a few minutes. <laughs> in the meantime, while I was on the phone with him, one of the gentlemen from the vehicle came in and purchased a pretzel okay. for 99 cents. How would, so, would you be able to identify, describe the gentleman? Yes. Um, so he was had a beard. He looked to be Latin in descent. He had on a blue shirt, um, and I, I believe it was black pants. Um, you know, he spoke with a pretty heavy, like Latin American accent. Yes, yeah, and, I knew, uh, yeah, he, he just purchased a pretzel for me in cash okay. at the register that I was standing at, and then he left the building and went back to pump thirteen. Bravo three was fun. Ten twelve with the driver of the uh, van. You can get the uh, complaint and stuff out. Watch how they attempt to deny their crime. Be any reason why they're saying that you guys didn't pay for gas? Huh? Any reason why they're saying that you guys did not <laughs> pay for gas? But you huh? Gas? I like the leaning, no, bro. I don't pull gas. Huh? I don't pull gas. You did not pull gas. Yeah. You say you just pulled the eat? Yes. Did you purchase something inside? Yes. Is this your work van? Yes. For what company? Mastek. No, this is my bank. It's your van? Yes. Can you step out for me? You step back here. You have ID? Okay. ID? ID? Okay. See, look, now all of a sudden he speaks English. Like, get out of here, bro. We knew you swept yeah. me. We so knew it. Man. At least I do. It should be management coming out. They said that uh, he, he says he's here. He pulled up to eat and drink uh, a monster or something. But he, he, he said Red Bull. Thank you very much. He said Red Bull. I gotta see this apparatus in the back of the car. That we need to find, it's gonna look something like that. Okay. And it's got two power leads going to it. Like that's how they steal gas the way he was just doing it. So this is a picture that came from my uh, loss prevention. That's right now. That's a current photo from right now. Oh, I don't know. These gentlemen? I don't think so. This is probably what we found on Riviera yesterday. So uh, we have these two detained at the pump. So like, what was going on with them was what we're trying to figure out. Oh, they just been stealing. They've been pumping fuel that they were stealing since 8.13 this morning. These gentlemen out here? Yes. Yes, right, goddamn. Sure. They have no, a device that looks like this. They've been stealing. These guys, and this, that white van. Yes, in the white van, the and two they gentlemen, they've been 13. stealing fuel since 8.13 this morning. How about how much? money we're talking and was it just was it both gentlemen do you do, did, did it seem like they were working in they're both there right now probably attaching the device right there because that was shortly after they pulled okay. up you could see them working so they something. both have involved it wasn't they like it was just one guy open the whole time Nine. obviously the block yeah, of you i mean it's very you know what i'm saying the officers reviewed the cctv footage in detail and knew exactly what to do next now that we had a felony amount you said a thousand you so the pump, pump that's on the machine, mm -hmm. 757 is what's on the machine. It's showing on the machine now. Mm -hmm. All right. So that's that. So that's the last transaction on that pump, and that's still showing on the pump itself. And it's still showing? Okay. Yeah. Right, so you have that, but what he's showing you is the updated, which he's, is 1,000. He's saying the guy behind the, the mask was that is the, This is the wildest shit ever. ever. So whatever device they have used or on the machine, Yeah. It doesn't, doesn't register, it just pumps gas on Dave, register. I'm going out with the officer, but I'm leaving my phone with you. She has her tracking vest on, Dave. <laughs> I have and my vest on, she's a good girl. And she has her helmet so on, you, and our work boots. <laughs> you have enough. We need to take control of these 15, get them in our car. Mm -hmm. I'll stay with them, and then you need to come in here and work your investigation. Okay. Let's go do this. You have enough to arrest them. Yeah. yeah. This is the one. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> Fair enough. <laughs> no one's under arrest right now. Is that good? being arrested. Just being detained. The Jews and cuffs. The, the, the irony of that, like, and the contradiction of that, like, as a person in the handcuffs, like, you're not being arrested. You're just being detained. Like, 
Is there a difference? I mean, I know that those two things do have different outcomes. Like, you can be let out of the cups or simply be in the team on the spot. But at the moment, it probably feels very much like being a master. was about 20 minutes before the van arrived and it was mm -hmm. only for $30. Okay. Again, definitely not going to justify them pumping gas for that for long. Yeah, for sure. Okay. So, mm -hmm. Uh, there was a recently another theft and they used some type of device. Yes. And you showed a picture as well, correct? Yes. Uh -huh. Can you explain was... that device again? Yes. So it looked like it had clamps, like mm -hmm. it was clamped onto a wire inside of our pump. Mm -hmm. um, and then it's like a box looking device. I don't know the technical terms, but okay. it was like a box looking device that it was attached with wires and clamps mm -hmm. inside like the gas pump area. And what it bypasses, how does it work? So apparently it bypasses, it you... just opens up the pump <laughs> to where they can, and they definitely tap Like do your diesel. job, bro. So I guess they, they this have is what you're supposed to go figure out. Regular fuel option, and they clamped right onto the diesel, which essentially opened it up without it and a pump as much. She is just doing it. She is a simple, I can do that. Oh, okay. Okay. five worker. But it's still secure on that side. They can easily uh, by pushing that door for it. All right, you good? All right, go ahead and open this bad boy up. See if you see anything. So, do we have a thousand gallons? A thousand dollars. A thousand dollars. 295 gallons? Jesus. They say it's most like an acrylic tank in the back. So, make sure your body camera can show that she's struggling to open yeah, something that yeah. she usually wouldn't have to because she has the. So, yeah, this, I think. Can we open up another one just to compare it? Yeah, let's actually have like phone still inside, right? Yeah, sorry, I love it. No, that's okay. They would probably be able to tell us. This that's the same. Do you have a, a technician? This is the same. I my internal tech is here right now, actually. Can he? My fuel tech is not, but he might be able to help okay. us. Alright, let's get let's get somebody. The suspects seemed quite clever, as there was no alteration to the pump system and no devices were visible until the police officer opened the car door. They, 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 they had a USB. They had a USB on them. Well, look at well, look at this, gentlemen. Oh, they got it right there. There it is. That's it, right there. It's right in their van. That's it. So I open the car door to turn the car off. That's mm -hmm. it. And all that's right there. Yeah. Pull it out. I gotta see what this thing looks like. Yeah. Super confused. I'm super interested in I'm investing in this guy in the video now. So, pull it out. So, I wanna see what this thing looks like. Come on. Put your gloves on and pull it out. Like the latch is in here. Yeah, I know, I know. All right. So, the bottom corner that was open on that side. We opened it up. I can't see anything, obviously, but did you see anything out of place? Everything was on that side. We just, I just brought this up for comparison. Okay, uh, what I'm gonna do, I've already talked with the hardware's, I can call in Tiger, okay. and they will come and do everything else from, yeah. from here. Okay. So what do they do? That's done right there, but Tiger, when you come and they wanna do the... the, the whatever, the, yeah, whatever somebody can take and say, I know what I'm doing, yeah. uh, this is wrong, or this is out of place, because I don't know, this looks like a... I know. We yeah, check for obvious stuff yeah, like every this, time we're on. That's an empty paper right. roll. Okay, one was in there and one was up there. That's, yeah, that's All just right. empty paper. Yeah. So, but, like, I can, like, so if that skimmer was on there, I would have seen it. But if right. there's one wire out of place, I ain't going to be able to tell. Right. Like, you know what I'm saying? Because the dude has a thumb drive on him. Uh, I don't know if you, like, pull this out and put that in, you know okay, what I'm saying? Okay, yeah. Can you call, can you get Tiger? Can I call John Fox so we can have to go? You don't mind? Thank you. Oh, so... The entire tank to which the gas was being transferred had been rigged very professionally, as if they had been doing this for a while. Holy. So, I don't think it's actively leaking. I think when we when we tilt it, it just the maximum. Because it doesn't look like it's leaking, you all look. It doesn't look like it's actively leaking. It just. I don't have a problem. Let me ask my detective to make sure he's good with that. Okay. Long as he's good with that, I'm. Um, okay. I don't see why it's. Yeah, it's, it's got to go from the very top. Yeah, it, it, it had his. 
I said, that I got, meters? I got one right here. Yeah, one on five. What the heck? Oh, so it's you guys. <laughs> This is the craziest. What's it say? Like, bro, I'm just like, what the hell? Like, uh, they, definitely, China, they definitely China. were doing this, yeah. bro. Like, this was not their first rodeo, yeah. second, third, fourth, fifth. Yeah, it says that weight, 100, this was This kilos. is a refined system okay. that took yeah, many, 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 you know, know attempts and mess ups to get a system that just works and looks like it was put together by someone who knew what they were doing. I'm just saying, I agree with the cop. I agree with the people like this is just looks professional. Yeah, I'll make sure up top and then I'll close the seal. I don't know what I'm looking at. And we'll make it for a little more So it's, it's got a 275 gallon tank. It's filled up to the top. Then we'll get a ladder to make sure at the top there's like nothing to leak at the top. That's what it looks like. It was just tilted. It leaked out a little bit. You want to take a picture of the tank? All right, I'll send it to you and then, once you get the ladder, look up top. Now, they're asking if they can store it outside. Is that good? Or no? It's all dry? Okay. So it's probably... It probably leaked out when it was tilted hard. Yeah. Or whatever gas was left in the line. They stole around $1,000 worth of diesel and did $1,500 worth of damage to the pump. They were charged with theft of fuel, unlawful transportation of fuel, and criminal mischief of over one thousand dollars. <laughs> YouTube thinks you'll love the video that is on wild, screen, bro. Like that is a crazy like situation. Like some of us are like, you know, man, I got a good idea for something crazy. You know how you know what I'm saying? And some of us just really just go do things. Like I don't think they thought it all the way through, but I don't think that they really cared to think it all the way through. Getting caught was just a part of the plan. You know what I'm saying? Like when you're doing nonsense like this, bro. Getting caught is a part of your plan. You 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 got to be smart enough to just write it into the blueprint. You know you're gonna get caught one of these times. You know what I'm saying? Like you gotta just be prepared for that, and hopefully you put enough money up for them lawyers, because uh, that's what you're working for. That you get you you making all that money to save it to give to a lawyer. So when you do get caught, you can stay out, and you know, yeah, that that that's that's the reality of that situation. So, anyways, do y'all think he, they got enough stuff? You know, is there enough issues or things that happened? Like, did you know what I mean? Should they have been charged with more? I don't know. I'm just saying. Did, were they clever? They were definitely goddamn clever. I didn't even want to argue that goddamn fact. Anyways, man, I'll catch you on the next one. Peace. <laughs>